How you doing? I'm Dr. Paul. Welcome to another mental health moment tip. You know, I've been practicing meditation and the art of Zen for some time now. And I call it, you know, there's a couple of ways of meditation. It's called point to point. And point to point means to clear the mind and move along the path between the now and the now. Let me see if that makes sense. So why? here's the healthy mental health tip. Choose a practice. Choose any action that will allow you to move within the thought and not a cure or to harbor outside thoughts. So why I'm here painting or drawing, what I'm doing is taking the time to just move from point to point within the practice. This is a tip that we can do, and this is why hobbies help. It, it allows you to step outside yourself so you can be inside the hobby. It helps you clear the mind process so you can create within yourself. One of this practice is about meditation and, and the act of healing. And this has been going on for thousands of years, is, is, is to not harbor, or, or harbor a grievance. It is to not have destructive action of thought. This is created by you not to reattach to the past. That's why if it's whatever practice you are choosing, whatever practice you're involved in, you put your mind in that practice. You put your time in that practice. Because when you harbor past thoughts and grievances, it only disrupts and causes sickness. The art of practicing of healing is to clear the mind so the body can heal itself. And when the body heals itself, it doesn't produce any chemicals for the mind to go back to the original sickness that is causing the sickness. Point to point meditation that I've been, you know, point to point meditation is to really go through the body, to really go through the substance of your beginning in the beginning. And you don't do this by creating an end. I'll say this again. You don't do this by creating an end. So when you're doing a hobby and when you're in the act of a hobby, you allow yourself to be clear and present with yourself. If something is disrupting you, that is something for you to just stop for a moment and write it down because that is causing your reharboring a grievance. Moving along the future is to not yet have arrived. You don't arrive at the future. You just are beginning over and over and over with each breath, with each moment seems kind of odd, seems kind of weird for most people because so many people think about what is, what isn't, what hasn't, what could be, and it has disrupted their lives. And the reason why it disrupts their lives is because it brings in so much pain. I hope this helps you. I know it helps me. I'm Dr. P, and this is the Mental Health Moment Tip. I will see you again next week, but you can look on past recordings and past videos or past podcasts to see the other tips. May you be compassionate, may you be blessed, and may you stay with a practice. Thank you.